Right then, good morning, here we are, the Maestro van. Came in yesterday. I'll go around it for you. Austin's equivalent, I suppose, to the, um, well it was, wasn't it, to the Escort van. And, arguably, mechanically, or even all round, arguably as good a van, I would suggest, really. I love that two litre diesel in there. They're a bit rowy, but they went well, they pulled nice. And they sounded um, like they had a little bit of guts. Now the gentleman has put in two or three different bits and pieces. Um, and I just opened the doors this morning and thought, ooh, we've got a load of stuff. Uh, which is, some of it is obviously clearly Maestro Van. Um, so anything in there, ladies and gentlemen, anything in there that's Maestro Van is going to go with the Maestro Van. Anything that might not be Maestro Van, i.e. that is not Maestro Van. I can only find them that headlamp and those two lamps, for argument's sake, are not Maestro Van. So my only concern at this stage is that box, for argument's sake, might go with something else that he sent down and, and, the, and the, his lads have just thrown it all in. But if it's Maestro Van, it stays with it. There's a load of bits and pieces in there. I think that's the fairest way of saying that, isn't it? Right. So we shut them up. We'll have another look around this inside of this one. And then... Oh, I'll tell you what I didn't mean to leave out. Um, there we are. Now, um, I assume that the majority of this, not all of it, is going to be Maestro Van. But again, Maestro Van, they are, so that one is for sure, isn't it? There we are. But my my only concern is that there might be a envelope in there which I'll get the office to go through. There might be an envelope in there with some information on one of the other cars, possibly, if they've just popped it all in. But it looks to me like nine tenths of it are Maestro Van. So anyway, there we are. So we'll have a look around the outside. In actual fact, we've got two Maestro vans in at the moment. Both white. I think one's got a roof rack on and one hasn't. From different sources, as far as I'm aware. So if you buy both of them, you're certainly, surely going to make one decent one out of two, aren't you? But anyway, there we are. So I'll do a few more photographs for you. You've got a month to come down and have a look should you be interested, and please do.